you remember the first time you faced Jordan? What was that, 93? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I remember the first time I faced Jordan. But how about this? We're playing him, I think it's the year they won 72 games. I don't know. But he's sitting in the, he's sitting in the arena on his Ferrari. And I, I think I told somebody this, but this is the only time I let a teammate down. I feel like I threw a teammate under the bus. So I'm getting off the game. It's game three or game two. We're playing in the arena, and he's in the arena smoking a cigar. He's smoking a freaking cigar before the game as if it's over. So Jawan and I get off the bus, and, uh, and he's like, yo, who's checking me today? And this is when you're supposed to say, man, shut up, man. We about to, we about to beat y'all. But Calvin Chaney walks on, off the bus after us, and we all look back like, uh, this would be your victim this evening. And he went on to score 54 there in Chicago. <laughs> so I just remember how <laughs> I just remember how cutthroat he was and uh, how competitive he was. And you know, playing against him and playing against Kobe with that Shaq team. You know, I, I know that I've played against some of the best players. Um, and uh, I, I tell you this, I haven't played against Curry in this state, um, but I see what he does. And uh, I, I just don't know how you would check him, especially with the pick and roll, especially with his range and the fact that. He gets to the hole. We don't give him credit. The reason why he's such a great shooter is because, one, he's a great shooter. Secondly, is because he can get spaced with his dribble. But he's not just getting space to back up or to step back. He will take it to the hole and lay it up over the tallest, the most intimidating shot blocker. And all those skills together um, is what makes him, you know, one of the greatest to me.